floating snacks. Everybody, Sid is back here, Awesome Con Day 2 2015. Also here with me, I got you. And on the other side, I always got with me. Gay. And we are here with people of First Law of Mad Science. Yeah, cool. so uh, what's your name, first of all, most of the people? I'm Oliver Mertz. And I am Mike Eidenberg. Cool. Okay, and with this, who does what here with this First Law of Mad Science? We uh, we are both the writers. We co-write. Um, our artist is uh, uh, Daniel Lapham lives out in Montana. So okay. Big big for him to come to the, to the show. But. Got you. Understand. So tell us a little bit about what you got going on, on the table. Here. All right. Well, here uh, we have sort of like our convention pitch. Uh, uh, I'll tell you about. So here's the story. So first of all, mad science is the story of a super scientist who creates cyber eyes. Cyber eyes are cybernetic retinal implants that allow the users to zoom to record to see beyond the visual spectrum. It's a wildly successful, world-changing product. So much so that two pieces of the world's population actually get these cyber eyes. The trouble is, a year after they go to market and everyone has these things, they find that the very first test subjects, including the super scientist's own son, they start seeing these terrible, terrible creatures, weird things, horrible visions everywhere that no one else can see. So now it's up to the super scientists to figure out, is this a malfunction of the cyber eye tech? Are the test subjects hallucinating seeing these things? Or is it something real they've now discovered and come into contact with that they now need to engage with and deal with before everyone in the world who has these cyber eyes right. starts seeing these things causing mass hysteria worldwide panic? Right. So it's that mystery that pulls the super scientist and his whole family into this globe-trotting, high-stakes adventure where they come into contact with sinister cults, ancient civilizations, corporate conspiracies, killer robots, a little bit of everything, but it's everything we love. It's like a tense mystery, fun adventure, and hopefully a good read. No. Nope. No, nope. no. Nope. So I see you got something over there too called Fubar. Yeah, what we got Fubar. Yeah, so Fubar is a uh, is an dom historical zombie uh, short story anthology. Mm -hmm. uh, we have contributed to. So we don't we're not the editors, we didn't publish these, but we have uh, stories in most of these volumes. This one is all of American history, uh, from the, the Vikings first coming to the continent, the Roanoke colony, all the way up through the moon landing to present day, but with zombies. Cool. And then this is uh, ancient history, all pre-gunpowder. So we've got Arthurian uh, knights, um, uh, Roman legions, uh, you know, ancient Chinese soldiers, uh, but with zombies. So how long have you all been uh, writing? We started writing First Law uh, at the very end of 2008, and we were writing for about a year and a half before we even uh, like approached an artist. Uh, and then issue one, we, we debuted at New York Comic Con in 2010. Okay. Uh, so we've been working since that came out. It's been about we've been about trying to do an issue to a year. Uh, we've been trying to do more than that, but we're self-published, so it, it's a little hard to get a. Takes a little. But uh, but yeah, so we uh, about five years. Okay, cool. Another side question. Next year, uh, Civil War comes out. Who's team you on? Captain America, or Iron Man. Iron Man. Oh, what? Do you see his face, man. Iron Man. No, I go with Iron Man. It's gonna be a fight here. It's gonna be a civil war right here. Like, what is going on? Picture in the back. Right. Yeah, yeah. But I can't get my Captain America. Captain America is too squeaky clean. Well, he's not going to war. That's all I need. Stand up. He don't want to go underground. This is. All right. All right. Iron Man's the one who wants to get everyone registered and like the registration thing. Oh yeah. Captain America's like, that's not the American way. We're gonna fight back. Okay. 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 I'm going right. stress. I think you changed your mind. Change your mind. He's talking to me too. That's what I'm talking about. Right, right there. Pitch you for your team. You know what I mean? Pitch for your team. Where they can find y'all. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Reach out. Give them all your information. Yeah, that would be great. So we're actually, we've just launched a Kickstarter to uh, collect all of our issues, put it all together, and uh, and put it into one book. It's all going to be in color. It's 164 pages of sci-fi horror adventure. Uh, and uh, that Kickstarter you can find on our website, firstlawmadscience.com, or go to Kickstarter and search for First Law Mad Science. Do cool. you guys have Instagram, Twitter, any of that kind of we stuff? Got, we Twitter, got or First Law Twitter. Comment. Yeah, Twitter first at First Law Comment. Okay. And then Facebook, you can find us uh, uh, Facebook slash First Law Mad Science. Cool. Right. Cool. Thank you very much. We really appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Loading snacks. <laughs>